Mm-hmm. Hey, what's up? How's it going? Alright. Let me see. Where am I? Oh yeah, okay. I remember where this is, I think. Um... Okay. Um, There we go, okay. Um, hmm. uh, don't get the game, but let's see. I don't need to jump off there because that just takes me back down where I was. I'm not afraid anymore. Yo, what's up, Rando? How's it going? I thought that might be you. I'm not. I wasn't sure though. What's up, Rama? Dude, this game is sick. I like this game a lot, actually. Did you play Bloodborne at all? Everyone's saying this game is like Bloodborne. I guess I could see it. I mean, it's kind of hard to not make that comparison when the game like pays such an obvious homage to a uh, Bloodborne, but at the same time, it really kind of does its own thing. Kind of reminds me more of the first Dark Souls game, which is weird. But there definitely are things that it that it borrows from Bloodborne, I guess. I don't know, man. I don't know if I'd call it a, a Bloodborne clone, but you can see the influence for sure, but weirdly, I just feel like it has more in common with uh, Dark Souls 1. I don't know why. You know, not much, Rando. What are you up to? Play everything except Bloodborne. Okay, gotcha. Dude, I don't know, man. I really... I really kind of think this is more like the first game, in my opinion, but... I haven't got through the whole thing yet. Hold on, I want to do something real quick. New... Window... I tried to, like, add chat to the, uh... the scene here, but fucking... Didn't do it right. Hold on. Oh. God damn it. Okay, hold on. How the fuck, mate, do I fucking... How the fuck do I fucking do this? Hope you're doing well, Rando. Ad dropping, no worries. <laughs> Background color. I don't even know why I'm doing this right now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me just test this out real quick. Don't mind that, just ignore that. 
I still can't see it. What the fucking shit? Oh wait, that might help. Okay, I'm sorry. Uh, okay, I fixed it. All right. Enough of that bullshit. Hope you're doing okay, Rando. Gemini's emergency protection. Ooh. Emergency protection, huh? What's through here? Oh yeah, this is the the elevator that goes where again? I like the elevators in this game. I know it's like a weird thing. A weird thing to praise a game for, but... They just, uh, I like them. I don't know. Crap, damn it. I can't find the way out. Monsters everywhere. I need to grab my share and leave. Who's this guy? Oh god, this is a very... See, this reminds me of, like, Honor Londo in Dark Souls 1, honestly. I, I, I don't know, the combat it definitely is, like, blood y at times, but... I feel like the general... I don't know. It's weird. It's in a weird spot between the aesthetics of Bloodborne and the aesthetics of, like, Dark Souls 1. Because, like, this right here reminds me of on, Or on Orlando, like, big time. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's odd. I thought I was the only one with a sound mind here. Sure, I don't need to introduce myself. Note these golden wings. Yes, you guessed it. You don't know who I am. Preposterous. Everyone in Krat has heard of me. Do you live under a rock? I'm yes. Alidoro the Hound. Treasure hunter extraordinaire. Yes, yes, it's a nickname. I ditched my real name in the past. I'm looking for other survivors of this disaster, but it's uh, been a lonely search, and there's danger around every corner. Do you know of a place where I can take refuge? Preferably someplace clean and comfortable, you know, civilized. Uh. I probably shouldn't have told him that. Of course, a haven for all, and it's still safe and sound, you say. I have a lot of searching ahead of me, so why don't I lighten my load? Consider this an act of charity. But thank you. Damn, she like directly warned me not to tell people about it. Since you're so helpful, uh, I'll damn give it. you a peek at my collection. But I thought maybe this guy will sell me some cool shit, so. Rare Ergo. Kill strong enemies to gain rare Ergo. Oh, this is the boss guy, the boss weapon guy. Alidoro is. A, yeah, okay. Well, fuck me. That's cool. What does this do? Dancing one's amulet. Enables dodging even with low stamina. Amulet that can be equipped on a puppet. Information memories, blah, 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 blah. The best parade is never swayed by any obstruction. One must be... Enables, wait, increases weapon attack in proportion to the number. Fable slots. Okay. What is this? It's called the etiquette. And it's a dagger that looks like an umbrella. Absolute counterattack. Perfectly block the enemy's attack temporarily. The bastards. The inglorious bastards. They call themselves the bastards. What is this again? Holy Sword of the Ark. That looks cool. That looks like a cool sword. 
Oh, this can't be disassembled because it's a a boss weapon. Okay. Seven coil spring sword. That thing is very ugly, but it might be really strong, though. I don't know. Upon a successful perfect guard, temporarily increases damage inflicted by what? That's pretty cool. I like that. That's neat. Uh, the only thing that sucks is I want this sword, too, though. I don't know. Maybe the sword's not that great. It looks cool, though. It looks pretty fucking cool. Patient smash. Gather your strength for a strong hit. Hold down the attack button to activate a stronger attack. I don't get what they mean, but okay. Transforms the length of the handle. If you're transforming stamina consumption is reduced temporarily. That's weird. It's weird. Special great sword that was lying asleep in Saint Angelico Cathedral. It can transform between a special great sword and a glaive. It can? Oh shit. That seems like such a cool amulet though. I want to have this too. I want this too. Well, fuck my face. I know I don't want this. What does this do? Increases attack in proportion to number of fable slots. I guess I'll buy that. I don't know. And then I'll buy this amulet and This really ugly sword. Alright. As a descendant of aristocrats, the very best family. And part of that duty is ensuring these items are. What I'm showing you is just a portion of the collection. If you Until then, remember. Nito. Oh, that thing's weird. Oh, that thing's also weird. Actually, that thing's kind of sick. That looks kind of sick, actually. Hold up. How do you transform this thing? I don't think I actually care for this weapon much. It said it transforms into a glaive. How do you do that? How do you do it, mate? Is it altar? Yeah, okay, I guess it does. How long does it stay transformed, I wonder? Um, plus Y. Oh, cool. Does it stay transformed for a while? That is so bizarre. Oh, but you can just... Okay, you can... It stays transformed. And then you have to use, like, one of those to reach... Okay. 
I get it. I get it now. That thing looks so weird, dude. This thing looks cool. Wow. You got like the fucking Benini works. You've got the uh, town. What is it called? Crot. Like town station or something? Town center. What is, what is that? What the fuck is that called again? You got Crot City over there. Man, that's crazy. I thought I saw like a snowy. Yeah, over there, there's like. There's like a building in the mountains. I want to check that out. Mm -mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Sorry. To next, I don't know. Let's not get decay poisoning, please. Please, sir. Uh, please, sir. Uh. Okay. Again, please, sir. Uh. Oh, there's one of those things I can push over. Noise. I see, okay. So you have to go this way. And then up here. Get away from me. Oh, yeah, burn it all up. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Cecil's unwell again. Today, the Adams brothers found her standing, standing like one of the dead at the edge of a cliff and brought her back. It's mild sleepwalking, it's fine, but I'm worried. It's her old blood compulsiveness again. Old blood compulsiveness. What? Hmm. What is the point of having XX slash XX? Like, what? I have their relic in my hand thanks to Cecil or Cecile. I don't know, Cecile maybe. I won't let those bastards ruin Crod anymore. This will purify the city. Maybe it was a mistake to accept those guys from the beginning. This disaster was divine judgment. 
people always say that kind of shit. They should have been turned away all those 30 years ago. But this will be the end. Kra is a city blessed by God, and I, Andreas, will come to its rescue. Why me? Okay. What was that? Something about Holy Mark. Weight goes up yet again. Physical damage reduction rate also goes up. Star Kitty, thank you for the raid. How's it going? Panda in shorts, how's it going? How is your stream, Star Kitty? Hope you're doing well. Let's see, what were you streaming today? Let's find out. Thank you so much for the raid. Welcome in, everybody. Playing some Lies of P, which is like a Pinocchio Dark Souls clone. The Queen of the Cosmos and her minions. The minions. I can't help but think of the um the minions from uh what's it called? Despicable Me or whatever. It's going pretty well, I guess. I mean kind of just started uh streaming but for tonight but uh yeah it's going well so far panda in shorts was carrying my ass through some dungeons nice welcome in by the way panda in shorts i think i said that but hopefully hopefully i said that but if not Nice, you're playing some Diablo 3. I haven't played that yet. I want to, though. I want to eventually. Um. What did I just pick up? Oh, it was one of these things. The hell is this? A holy mark obtained by the Archbishops. Or uh, obtained from the Archbishops. Okay. Weird. What did that say about him being a murderer? They say his moral influence even made murderers repent before God. That's not... That doesn't sound like the... I don't think they passed the vibe check. The Archbishop. Oh, do you, if you posted a link, it's probably going to block it. I don't know why... Uh, I don't remember which which thing it is that blocks links, but something does. I'm sorry. Um, would you be able to send it to me on Discord, maybe? I could watch it on uh, Discord, probably. I'm sorry that it it blocked your link. It just does that. I don't know why. Yeah, it's just one of those things. I can't remember if it's like Twitch itself or stream elements or stream something else. But well, something... Something blocks links in chat. I never did find out what. Are you liking Diablo 3 so far? Or wait, was it Diablo 3 or 4? 3, okay. I played a lot of 3, actually. I like that game. I think it's fun. I think it's just good, like, simple action RPG fun, you know? It's a pretty good time. People get really, people get really into it and like do the hardest difficulties and stuff. I've never done that before, but 
I do think it's a fun game, though. Where the hell am I going? Pull the chain? Oh, I see. Nice. Okay. Yeah, I love Diablo 3. Hell yeah, that's awesome. Have you have you played it much before? Mindless entertainment, yeah. Yeah, that is pretty much how I would also describe it. You just kind of like mindlessly grind through tons of enemies. What kind of character are you playing as? I forget who I played as, but there's this one character that's kind of like, I don't know, I think they might be called like a crusader or something, but they're kind of like the holy knight archetype with like a big smashy hammer type thing. I think they look really cool. I don't know if they're actually a good, a good character, but they look cool as hell. Main is a barbarian, but my secondary is a, oh cool, demon hunter. Thank you. Just seeing the Archbishop's holy mark renews my spirit. It's a reminder of the quiet power of faith. I'll remember this forever, Stalker. Yeah, Crusader. The male is voiced by a favorite voice actor, actually. Really? Who's that? And, uh... Like, what are your some of your favorite works Fire by them? That, Yo, Kool-Aid. What's up? How you doing? It's a reminder of the quiet power of faith. It's a reminder of the... Man, she looks... Like she's had a rough day. Looking uh, a little gaunt there. But... It happens. It do be like that sometimes. Anyway, thank you so much for the raid. Um, if you need to uh, take some time to de-streamify, you know, then uh, by all means, take as much time as you need to, uh, you know, recover post-stream, basically. I can definitely take it out of you for sure. Um, I'm not sure where I should go next. I think I already got all the crap over here. I believe. That hurt me, seriously. God, the fall damage here is brutal. Gideon Emery. He did Fenri Fenris? In Dragon Age 2. Dragon Age 2. Dragon Age is like... One of those RPGs by... Uh, whoever did like Knights of the Old Republic, right? What is that company called? Shit, I forgot. Oh god, St. Andreas. I have a feeling this guy's gonna be... A holy terror. Bioware. Okay, okay. Thank you. I forgot about that. Forgot about the name of the company. Whatever. The name slipped my mind there. A lot of credits and other stuff, too. He also did a Balthier in... I didn't play Final Fantasy XII, huh? Everybody liked, seemed like everybody liked to hate on that one. Bioware. They also did that one game. Um, what was it called? It's supposed to be like based on like Eastern. 
you know, culture, I don't know. What the hell was, I don't even know. It's on Game Pass, Jade Empire, yeah, there you go. God, I can't remember shit today, holy crap. My memory is garbage, garbageo. He's also in World of Warcraft, Guild Wars 2, Fallout 76, some Star Wars, holy crap. Yeah, it's quite a few credits, damn. I'll use my power. Will you though? Will you use your power? At the house of an I always welcome. I know my way around the way. I know you do. Oh, no, you do. Now, which level, which one do I level up? Probably not the baton, I guess. I keep leveling up this weapon. I don't even necessarily like it that much, but I just, I don't know. How oh, cool. Dark Moon, Moonstone of the Covenant. That is the longest name ever, that item. Um, hmm. So what is it now? Is it stronger than my other weapon now? No. It's not, but does some other stuff better. But yeah, I'm just playing this game where you play as Pinocchio and do puppet stuff. I don't know. It's like a Souls a Souls like a Souls like game with Pinocchio in it. People have thanks for keeping. I'm doing a really bad job of selling this game as any good, but uh, I really like this game a lot so far, actually. I would give it... I haven't finished it yet, so... You know, take it with a grain of salt, I guess, but... Welcome to Hotel. What I have played, I would give like a glowing recommendation, because... I'm very much enjoying this game. It's very pretty to look at but also really fun to play but I do love the world and the graphics and like the story and everything okay let's see can I oh, I have two more quartz nice increase okay add fable slots Retain guard regen, regain, whatever. What does that mean? Retains a certain amount of guard regain when receiving damage. Oh, it's just like, okay, I see. That's like the rally system or whatever. Okay, I gotcha. Rising dodge, that seems useful, but I don't know. Add an amulet slot. Ooh. Okay, okay. How about if I do this? What? What? What did I just do? I have no idea what I just did. I need to, I need to uh, play Diablo 4, though, at some point. I keep meaning to buy Diablo 4, but I'm kind of just, like, waiting for it to go on sale at this point. Like, I've waited long enough to where I feel like I should just wait for it to go on sale. Okay, so let's see. Enhance Fatal. Blah, blah, blah.
Enhance fatal attack. Attack. Enhance fable arts. Enhance guard regain recovery. I wish I knew what some of this meant. That's very uh, difficult to like try and figure out what the hell that would amount to. Enhance perfect guard destruction. Enhance ambush stagger attack. Enhance weapon attack when discharged. Enhances weapon attack when durability is at maximum one. I don't actually know what that means. Enhanced pulse cell recovery. That's pretty cool. Lowers guard regain. Okay. Everybody loves a, uh, what do you call it? What do you call oh God, I can't think of anything today. What the fuck? Um... I don't know. I can't remember what you call that type of progression thing. Skill tree. I'm thinking of skill tree. Everybody loves a skill tree. Sometimes skill trees are done really well, sometimes not so much. I didn't really like, um, like the, the sphere, the sphere grid in Final Fantasy X wasn't really for me. I don't know. I kind of thought it was annoying and confusing, but the kitty, oh, kitty still hates me. What the fuck? Kitty, why do you hate me? Why? Why? Damn. Oh well. Oh well, I guess the video game cat just hates me. Just have to pretend like that didn't ruin my day. Okay. We'll go to the... What do you call this? Uh, St. Frangelico Church or something. I believe I got everything here. I don't know. I believe I found everything. It's a reminder of the quiet. I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. It's so funny when I block with this sword. He doesn't like lift it over his head. It just clips right through your neck. Just. But it would be kind of stupid if... Oh my god, I hate this area. I forgot about that. You must chill. You must chill. I'm very confused though. Like why? What is this area? Did I go to the right place? Oh my god, I stepped on the fucking thing again. Come on, you bastard. Oh, 
Wow.
I am very confused now. So what, that's just like on the other side of that? Okay, there's the stargazer. Oh, and then I went all the way, okay. That's right, I went all the way around. That seemed so much closer than I guess it actually was, okay. So. There's a butterfly around here somewhere. Oh, come on. It disappeared? Oh. Okay, you know what? I fucking hate traps. That's really annoying. Oh no, what? I swear if I miss that permanently, I'm gonna be really sad. That's not a good sign. Maybe if I load back in, it'll reappear. You never know. Good, I guess. This game kind of reminds me of Demon Souls Remake. I don't know why. It's not too dissimilar from Demon Souls remake. I don't think I ever streamed that, did I? I'll have to stream that someday. Cause that game is awesome. Damn it, I missed the freaking stupid ass thing I'm thing. Okay, so, no, don't do it, okay. Almost stepped on the trap again. How in the fucking world? I just cannot figure out the direction of this, but that's okay. Fuck you. I got an advanced crank, okay. Not really what I wanted. That's right, I got that thing too, okay. I got a technique crank and an advanced crank. Oh, and a legion plug. And a butt plug, I'm just kidding. High powered flame amplifier. What does that do?
I'm slightly heavy now. Come on, dude. I'm always slightly heavy in this game. It's bullshit, mate. Hmm. Well, shit. Gemini. The Gemini. Don't step on that. Don't step on a crack. All right, here we go. This is going to be rough, I think. Ew, what the fuck? That guy is terrifying. That's what it looks like when I smoke too much. That's what my vision is like. <laughs> no, not really, but... LSD vision. Oh, God. Oh, no. No, no, no. Ew. Guy is so creepy. What the? Fuck? Whoa. That thing's blood is like Baja Blast.
Oh god, there's probably another phase, isn't there? There's no way that's it. There's no way. That was probably just like the easy part. No. Oh no. What evil hell is this gonna be? But no, the real Andreas. I was gonna say that centipede guy. Oh fuck, this sucks, dude. Dang. The boss designs in this game are crazy. Oh yeah, what's up, Kool-Aid? You've officially exited the tutorial. Oh no, oh no. Why would you say that? But I was trying to activate my. I was trying to activate my shame cube. Once I learn the timing on like parrying some of that stuff, I think that'll make it easier. It'll make it a little bit easier at least. I wonder if it'd be a bad idea to use the crot baton because. It's faster, but it's also shorter, so it's like... Also, I have these boss weapons now. Maybe I should try one of these. My weight goes up and my damage goes down. That sucks. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to summon anything. Even though it is an NPC, I don't think I'm going to summon anything. Damn it, why does it my... My shame cube never resets. Why is that? Does anybody know how to, like, make this better? Like... Dang it, I'm out of these freaking things now, and that means I have to teleport to here, talk to the top hat guy, get another one, equip it again. It's like, why does it do this? I thought it said it just like restocks it when you, when you rested a bonfire. Like, am I doing something wrong? That's why it doesn't reset. You have to have multiple of the same ones you're using. Oh. How do you get multiple? Well, I don't know. You don't have to tell me. It's okay. I guess maybe eventually I'll have multiple and then I won't have to do that as much. I don't know. It's kind of an inconvenience.
Okay, that was terrible. Why can't I block his attacks properly? I was watching somebody stream this earlier and they were getting real, real frustrated with the uh, parry mechanic in, uh, what the hell is the name of that boss where it's like, it's like the cop or whatever. It's like the, it's like the second big boss. The last boss of the tutorial. I was watching somebody get real pissed off about that. That should have staggered him, what the hell? Stupid son of a bitch. Uh, the bad thing is, like, I don't know. I don't know if I should keep using this weapon or not, because, like, I can't tell if it sucks. I mean, it's a little slow. It seems to do some decent damage, but... Maybe I should really switch to something else. Okay. God damn it. I know what decay is, you motherfucker. Uh, I hate it when games do that to you. It's not as bad as like Resident Evil or something though, where when you die, in like hardcore difficulty or something like that it's like do you want to lower the difficulty it's like no you stupid idiot i'm playing this for a reason i don't want to lower the difficulty that was so annoying Oh, 
Okay. You fuck. God damn it. They always do that. They always fucking get out of it. What is the point of staggering him if he just fucking runs away? Why does it keep doing that? Oh, shut up. Hmm, this is gonna be interesting. I have a feeling a lot of people are gonna quit at this point. I don't know, maybe not. Of course, I thought, like, the Watchman or whatever that guy's name was. That's also another one of those points where I'm sure a lot of people will be like, you know what, this is, this is not for me. I don't feel like doing this.
Dang, this sucks. This is gonna be rough. If I could just get a better, like, first round going, you know? Just get that... That first round better. But his moves are, like, really not... Easy to time. For the parrying. It seems like I'm always too late. Pick up the fucking souls. Gotta be fucking kidding me. Fucking bitch. God damn it. What was that? Some kind of stupid ass AoE attack. I knew it was going to be, but. I wish there was a way to farm souls. I mean. Can't you just farm them like anywhere? Or do you mean like it's just not practical to like run around and try to get souls in these areas? Because I could just go beat all these enemies over and over again, right? I mean, technically. Oh, 
Oh, God damn it. God, I seriously regret doing a, a strength build for my stream stuff. I should have just done dexterity. Because this weapon is so fucking slow. It takes like 10 minutes to attack every time. And you can't interrupt the animation, so it's like... Uh, and then it takes fucking 10 minutes to recover. It's just so stupid. I think I need to switch weapons, because this thing sucks. I really wish I would have done dexterity, I don't know. I regret doing strength in this game. I'm going to try to change my affinities on one of my dexterity weapons. And like, hopefully... Oh yeah, I can't, can I? I can't even afford... Or like, they don't let you buy more than one? Shut up, dude. Yeah, I can't buy another motivity crank, can I? Technique crank, which I don't need. I know my way around. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is what I want to use, the booster glaive blade. I don't know if it's actually faster, but I just like it better. I don't know, it's just like... I like the way it, um, I like the attacks, like, on this one better, but, shit, I don't know, I guess I could, like, I could try and mix and match, like, I could always, what I could do, I guess, is, like, This technically makes it faster, right? I'm gonna try this. I don't know if it's gonna help, but... Maybe if I... Use my brain a little bit, it'll... Oh shit, dude. Michael's Deli, what's up? What's up, Green77 Green? How's it going? The MF Deli Magi, how's it going? How you doing? Squid Super Hunk? Hello, I forgot to copy the raid. <laughs> it's okay. <laughs> Welcome in. Yo, how's it going, dude? How was your stream? What were you streaming tonight? Oh my god. Magi, thank you for the resub. 12 month. Holy shit, that's a long time. Let's fucking go. Thank you so much for the resub. And thank you for the raid. Appreciate it. Hello, I forgot to even put the, the raid message in the chat. It's all good. Alvin not Klein, nice. <laughs> Welcome in. Everyone forgot to copy the raid message. Dude, Liza P is crazy. This game, I don't even know. It's been really good up until, uh, kind of up until this boss is, like, now kicking my ass. Um, but it's not too bad. I've fought worse bosses, I guess, but... What were you, uh, what were you streaming tonight, by the way? Let me give you a shout out real quick. If I can, if I can handle that.
Yeah, we're playing some Liza P tonight. Um, playing it with the mouth controller. And uh, it's been good so far. I don't know. Yeah, this is the full game. It just came out, um, I want to say like a couple days ago or something. Less than a week ago. Sorry, I had a timer going off there. Um, I gotta take a break real fast, but... Yeah, I really appreciate the raid, though. Welcome in, y'all. Uh, what do I say about myself? I don't know. I uh, like a lot of Souls games, so chances are I'll probably be playing a Souls game. But I do play other shit, too. I was recently playing The Quarry, which I haven't finished yet. Because this game came out and totally... Eclipsed, uh, I guess. Playing FIFA, nice. Now called EA Sports FC, okay. You know, I've never been good at that game, but... It's fun to just, like, mess around in if you don't know what you're doing, but... Oh my god, thank you for the gifted sub, Magi, I appreciate that. Giving it to Michael's Deli, nice. Yeah, thank you so much for gifting a sub and for resubbing. I really appreciate that. All right, I'm going to try this guy like one time real quick, but he's most likely going to kill me again, so. Don't get too excited, that's just the first phase. Yeah, right, what a cute boss. Totally not scary at all, or terrifying. Definitely not, not, oh shit, okay. You son of a bitch. Alrighty. Okay. <laughs> Except God, he's so preachy. Damn Bible thumpers up in this place. Come on. Yeah, it's I feel like I can I might be able to pull it off here in a couple more tries, but it's been, uh, it's not been easy. Lost Ergo. But yeah, overall, though, this game is really sick. Like, I don't know. I really like the level design. I like the characters, the story. Pretty much everything about it. There's just... Some of the bosses make me kind of tilted, but... What can you do? I don't know. That's how it goes. Yeah, thanks again for that gifted sub, though. Magi, really appreciate that. Phase two. 
Gonna go make some dinner? Hey, yeah, no worries. Best of luck. Thank you so much, dude. Thanks again for the raid. Hope you have a good dinner uh, or lunch or I'm not sure what time it is, but maybe it's breakfast. I don't know. Either way, hope it's a uh, hope it's a good one. I'm gonna take a break real fast anyway. Oh god, okay. This is gonna be a long grind, I can already tell. I gotta get my grind set so I can rise and grind and uh all that all that good stuff, I don't know. Alright, anyway, I'll be right back. Thanks for watching.
I pause that? Alright, sorry about that. I am back now. see here okay good here we go here we go here we go <laughs> I gotta use that that sound command now by the way I do have a bunch of sound commands if you have some channel points and you'd like to use them there's one that I feel like hearing now. Hold on. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, push it out. Here's a dicky duck. Here's a dicky duck. Here's a dicky duck. God damn it. That's so ridiculous, that actor. I don't even know what his name is, but I always play somebody like really weird. You fuck. Oh shit. Magi, cheers. God.
Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> this guy sucks, dude. <laughs> what the... Oh, boy. Oh, boy. It is generous enough to start me off. Like, right next to... <laughs> right next to the boss room. I basically just die, wake up, and then immediately run. About, you know... A hundred feet or something. It's not too bad. Oh, shit. This is definitely gonna be one of those bosses where... Like, 50% of people who got this far are gonna quit. I hope I'm not one of them, but... Jesus Christ. Nah, I... I don't think I'll quit. I don't know. I usually don't quit games I like. Damn it. Here we go again. Okay, nice. This guy just really wants to sit on me. This is what I do, I sit on you. God damn it. Okay, cool. Sheesh, okay. This game is super easy. Even if this did have an easier difficulty, it's like, would I even use it? Maybe? C 
gonna just pick it up. Why do I always miss it? I gotta take a break from games like this for a while after this. I don't know what to play next. I was playing like the quarry, which is just completely story based. And the only difficulty is like those quick time event things. Where it's like, push the stick to the left. Whoa, you made it. But I don't know. I didn't finish it. I should probably finish that game. Because it is pretty cool, actually. First phase is easy enough. What in the world?
What the hell was that? That move is so fucked up. He just runs really fast and just crushes you with his, uh... Uh, with his, uh, I don't know what to call that. His hindquarters? I don't... There's like a monster for his... The back of his body, yeah, I don't know. His enormous ass just destroys me somehow. I don't know how you're supposed to block that, but okay. you
dang it, dude, it's so close. I had so little. <laughs> I just went for it and it totally did not pay off. It never pays off to just go for it in these games, I swear. Anytime there's an option where it's like, oh shit, maybe if I just mash the like the special attack button that uh I'll kill it, like it's always a bad idea. It's always a bad decision, god damn it. Uh, I feel like I'm starting to understand this boss. Sort of. Shit. Oh shit, did I do it? Oh my god, I just went for it again and it worked. It's like, fuck it, just mash the button, just do it. That was hard. I'm not gonna lie, that was pretty hard. Something weird is happening now. Like, I don't know why this cutscene is in like 30 frames per second. <laughs> oh well. Whoa, all these souls are like flying around doing crazy shit. I guess I unlocked something else now. And Who's that? Now, the stage is set. <laughs> the 
<laughs> as far as like cringy, like you know, super villain laughs, that one actually wasn't too bad. you can't because you goofed up and now I'll never forgive you and the church is stupid anyway <laughs> oh, all right where is that one person that I was helping she left seals written confession Thank you for your kindness. I'm a sinner who murdered innocent people in the past. I couldn't suppress the monster in me. Only the Archbishop saved me. Of course, he was a human who makes mistakes. Even saints succumb to wealth and power. But at least I can live as myself, and that's a huge blessing. So yes, I believe that he was a saint. Now... Now you open the second part, path. Thank you for letting me live as a human, not a monster. Cecile. Divine service. I got a new record. Let me go to the other, uh, the other, the other mother. No, the, uh, stargazer up here. God, that was freaking hard. That boss was not easy. What's this then? The dog guy is at the uh, hotel now. I swear to God, if this dog person starts causing trouble, I swear to God. Do I? Do I swear to God? You know that stalker? Wow, I, I didn't know he was still alive. Thank heavens. I haven't seen him in person. And I don't know how I'd react. How do you thank the man who saved your life? <laughs> I'm so glad that someone so kind has reached safety. And speaking of safety, please take care of yourself out there. He saved her? That's cool. You're not the only one who's curious. Most people get around to asking where I'm from. My looks give it away. I wasn't going to ask that, but okay. Suffice it to say, I'm from the country of the morning beyond the ocean but i wouldn't be much of a tour guide all i know about it is their weapons my family was a house of weapons specialists it's quite a reputation to live up to they almost took charge of planning for the grand exhibition but that's their reputation not mine and they deserted me when i was little i don't even know who they are and my reputation is my own. I suppose my only connection to them would be... weapons. So I'm an orphan, and that hardly makes me exotic and crot. Can I help you with anything else? Yeah, what? What did she just say? I kind of zoned out there. I don't know what... I don't know what she was going on about. Uh, do I want to switch any of these weapons? Or, nah. Oh shit. Jewel, thank you for the raid. How's it going, Jewel? Thank you so much for raiding. How was your stream? I didn't even know you were streaming today. Thank 
Hey, I didn't know you were streaming today. Went well, that's good. What were you playing tonight? Yeah, thanks again for the raid. Quality um, and superior Ramble the Mountain King. Hmm. I've never heard of that. Um, what's that about? My stream's been good, though. I just beat pretty difficult boss, so that felt pretty good, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, it's been good. It's been good. I can definitely crack open the uh, book of scary stories, though. Switch legion arm. Wait. Craft? Yeah. Craft legion arm. I don't really need flamberge. Because it's like not in my... It's not with my strength, but... I guess I could make it just because why not? I have the materials. Which one is this? See, this thing looks fucking cool. You block at the right time, it like blows up. That looks cool as shit. But I think I'm gonna try the fucking... The landmine one. Alright, let's make the landmine arm. Modify, huh? Increases the enemy detection time after installation? Okay. God, that thing's freaking massive. That's crazy. Okay. Let me, uh... Hold on. Let me crack open that there. of a bob <sighs> hold on a second where is my stupid uh in the lap there it is All right i don't even know what story i left off on to be honest It has been a while. The curse, I wonder. I wonder if, uh... I wonder if we've seen this one yet. I'm not sure. Let's see. Oh, this is one of those ones where... It... Okay, I'm not gonna do that one. Scary and funny. I know I've read that. The brown suit. Hmm. Hold on, let me see. Can't really remember exactly where we left off with. I know I've read, okay, Bed by the Window. I know I've read that. Dead Man's Hand, Ghost in the Mirror.
the curse. I think, uh, yeah, I've read that one. Sounds. What is sounds? Hey, yeah, I'm happy that you are back also. It's always good to see you. Um, have you just been just too busy to stream, really? Just have a lot going on outside of, outside of Twitch. Definitely happens, you know. Sometimes you gotta step away a little bit. Alright, I'm gonna read this one. It's called Sounds. It's kind of short, so I might read another one too, but we'll start here. Um, the house was near the beach. It was a big old place where nobody had lived for years. From time to time, somebody would force open a window or a door and spend the night there, but never longer. Three fishermen caught in a storm took shelter there one night. With some dry wood they found inside, they made a fire in the fireplace. They lay down on the floor and tried to get some sleep, but none of them slept that night. First, they heard footsteps upstairs. It sounded like there were several people moving back and forth, back and forth. When one of the fishermen called, who's up there? The footsteps, footsteps stopped. Then they heard a woman scream. The scream turned into a groan and died away. Blood began to drip from the ceiling into the room where the fishermen huddled. A small red pool formed on the floor and soaked into the wood. A door upstairs crashed shut, and again the woman screamed, Not me, she cried. It sounded as if she was running, her high heels tapping wildly down the hall. I'll get you, a man shouted. The floor shook as he chased her. Then silence. There wasn't a sound until the man who had shouted began to laugh. Long peals of horrible laughter filled the house. It went on and on until the fishermen thought they would go mad. When finally it stopped, the fishermen heard someone coming down the stairs, dragging something heavy that bumped on each step. They heard him drag it through the front hall and out the front door. The door opened, then it slammed shut. Again, silence. Suddenly a flash of lightning filled the house with a green blaze of light. A ghastly face stared at the fisherman from the hallway. Then came a crash of thunder. Terrified, they ran out into the storm. What's going on with the picture here? I know I've read all of these. I'm going to try this one, the window. Uh, yeah, I've just been busy, but I need to find a new balance. Oh, like you know, too much work and uh, not enough play, I guess, maybe. I don't know. Well, I hope you find a balance that works for you and stuff that, you know, makes you feel good about uh, your schedule and stuff. All right, I'll read one more here. Um, I actually need to take a break real quick first, but when I come back, I will actually read this one. Just need to take a break real fast.
Hey, thanks, Jewel. Appreciate that. Thought it was your playlist. Do you like this song a lot? This song is really good. I really like it a lot. I've been rocking this for, I don't know, at least the last 10 years now. It's a really, really good song. I'm looking for something a little... A little scary so I can it's in your playlist also that's awesome I'm glad you like it it's a really good song did you hear like the Magdalena Bay song too or I wasn't sure if you got stuck behind that ad or not but yeah Magdalena Bay is like a newer a newer uh favorite of mine they have some really good music though okay I'll put on something a little bit creepier to uh, read the story to I've read this one recently too, but I don't know, whatever. I'm just going to read this one. This one's called Wonderful Sausage. I know I've read it, but that's okay. One dark, rainy Saturday afternoon, a fat and jolly butcher named Samuel Blunt had an argument over money with his wife, Eloise. Blunt lost his temper and killed Eloise. Uh, then he ground her up into sausage meat, buried her bones under a big flat rock, in the backyard. To keep the murderer secret, he told everyone that she had moved away. Blunt mixed his new sausage meat with pork, then seasoned it with salt and pepper, added some sage and thyme, and a bit of garlic. To give it a special flavor, he smoked it in his smokehouse for a while. He called it Blunt's Special Sausage. There was such a demand for this new sausage that Blunt bought the best hogs he could find and started raising his own pork. He also kept a sharp lookout for humans who might make a tasty sausage meat. One day, a nice plump school teacher came into his shop. Blunt grabbed her and ground her up. Another time, Blunt's dentist came by. He was a little round man, and into the grinder he went. Then one by one, the children in the neighborhood began to, dis to disappear. And so did their kittens and puppies. But no one ever dreamed that Blunt the Butcher had anything to do with it. Things went on that way for years. Then one day, Blunt made a big mistake. A fat boy came into the butcher shop. Blunt grabbed him and started to drag him off to the sausage grinder. But the boy broke loose and ran out of the shop, and Blunt chased after him, waving a big butcher knife. When people saw this, they realized at once what had become of all the missing children and grown-ups and kittens and puppies. An angry crowd gathered at the butcher shop. No one knows for sure just what happened to Blunt that day. Some say he was fed to his hogs. Others say he was fed to his sausage grinder. But he was never seen again, and neither was his wonderful sausage meat. Wow. Alright. Well, that's terrible. Okay. Okay. I'm back. Hi. But yeah, thank you for redeeming the stories. I still gotta seek out like a new scary storybook. I still need to 
I've been invested. If my suspicions are correct. Let's find a new book, though, for sure. Very ergo is causing their aggression. My decoder can find malicious signals within the waves, but I cannot possibly get close enough to gather the ergo wave records myself. You, on the other hand, would you? Some folklore? That's a good idea. I. That's a really good idea, actually. The king of puppets is truly behind this, this puppet rampage. It's too simple, but also a bit too much even for him. I do so desperately want to find the cause, as I'm sure you do too, my friend. It breaks my heart to see puppets turned into murderous tools of bloodshed. I always welcome friends. People keep saying that Pinocchio in this game looks just like Timothy Chalamet, the actor. I don't know. I guess they do look similar. I mean, they do look similar. Apparently he's going to be playing Wonka soon. He's going to be playing Willy Wonka pretty soon. Should rock the cool glasses. I want to try out this landmine thing. Okay. That's what it does? Oh, you can do a bunch of them, damn. Is there anything else I need to buy from this guy? I don't think so. Let me check out this guy real quick too. Welcome to Hotel Wilk. Dark Moon Moonstone of the Covenant. Oh, that'd be cool too. Make more of those. Can only buy two? That kind of sucks. Sweet. Ooh, that thing's a lot heavier, but it's also a lot stronger. Maybe I just need to start playing slightly heavy. I don't know. Oh yeah, let me hear this new song. This game, you can like unlock records. It's kind of cool. But yeah, I just unlocked this record called Divine Service. It has like a really cool like... Uh, what do you call that style of art? Um, it has like a French name, like Art Nouveau or something. Is that? I don't know if that's right. I'm going to look it up real quick. Oh, 
Heart new new vote. Yeah. That's a really cool style. I really like that style a lot. This sounds cool. I like how this game has a bunch of original music. That's cool. They definitely didn't have to do that, but it's cool that they did. Anyone with a worthy spirit? However, you must prove it's up to you if you want to make the exchange. Twisted Angels Ergo. What is this to you? Nameless one's an amulet. Has a chance of none. Has a chance of none being consumed. Oh, when using a pulse cell. That'd be kind of cool if it just randomly didn't. But then you like you never know if it's going to or not. Trident of the Covenant. Cat's still gonna hate me. Kitty, why? Why does a stupid cat hate me? It's not fair. This is kind of a cool song. Welcome to What are you nuts? The city asked me and the game's called Liza P, dude. I'm not gonna not lie, you doofus. The ergo is whispering? What the hell is that all about? Oh, it's because I finished the song, okay. I can only afford one level? Shit.
Sophia. She's an interesting looking character, I guess. I noticed they added like earrings for some reason from the uh, demo to the full version. I don't know if that brooch was there too. She's also got some kind of pendant. I don't know what the pendant is, but cool character though, I guess. Or like a cool character design at least. Hmm. All right, well, I guess that's all I needed from here. I wonder if it affects me again if I listen to it or is it just like a one time thing? Almost over. Just a couple more seconds. I just want to see what happens. Will it? Will my springs react again? No. Okay. Never mind. I need to go get my shame cube back. This game's crazy. I like it. If you have Game Pass, you can check it out for free, I think. I believe it's on Game Pass. Gold coin trees. Shut up, dude. Nobody asked. Go back here and then I guess progress. Head to the next area. This is where I beat that really difficult boss. Is there a way into there? Probably not. No. I don't think there'd be a way in there. Okay. I just wanted to double check. I'm still underground, right? Yeah. That's crazy. How deep underground am I going to go? Damn. I'm like seriously underground now. Something about that kind of freaks me out. Thinking about being that far under the earth, just something about that idea makes me really claustrophobic or something. I don't know if that's the right word, but. Being hundreds of feet under the surface of the earth sounds terrifying. Oh shit, that was pretty strong. There's just bear traps. This is a cool weapon. Whoa. 
host of little importance. Before Elysian Boulevard was built, this place literally was all there was of Karat. But when some in the city prospered, they, they left the old town behind. Through isolation and neglect, Karat's first incarnation became nothing but dangerous alleys and desperate slums. On the bright side, I guess, the whole city of Karat's pretty much like that now. The old town caught up with the new. It's true what they say. A receding tide sinks all boats. They say that? You cannot use this right now. That's weird. I don't know what was up with that. I have a habit of never using the consumable items in these games. I have a habit of just like not ever equipping and using them for some reason. It just never seems like a good time. That was a cool attack. Oh my god, are you serious? Acidic Crystal Spear? There are some sick fucking weapons in this game. I kind of wish I had chose Advanced instead of Motivity. Because there are some really cool weapons that scale with Advanced. That shit is crazy. I want to use it so bad. Is this sword still stronger? No, it's not. Okay, never mind. It only goes down by 15, though. That's not too bad. What's over here? Oh fuck.
Good lord. He kept breaking my guard. bear traps everywhere. I can see why though there's a freaking giant bear just hanging out. Wait, hold on. Oh, I get it. not see that okay how did I miss that stupid bear trap I'm so close to dying. Fuck. I should have used my my mines. I do not want to fight that guy again.
Okay, well that's stupid. sucked. Oh, porta potty, nice. Sweet outhouse, okay. I think I killed one of them. Black Rabbit Brotherhood. Interesting. Hmm. I don't know, should I jump down there? I do, can I get back up? Oh well. I knew something was gonna fucking... Do that. I didn't think some fucking gremlin was going to jump out and immediately beat my ass. Dang, I'm all the way back here now. Son of a... Alright, I gotta take a break again real quick.
Um, but yeah, I'll be right back. Wow, this level is not easy. I don't know what I was expecting, but... But it turns out I actually can just run by this bear. Of course I went the wrong way.
Star fragment? That's not worth it. I don't even care about those. I have no plan on even using those. Oh god. What? God, this sucks. I get up there, I wonder. Not this way. Oops. Oh, that's what it was. Okay. That makes sense. The reason everyone turned into a zombie is because they started taking that sketchy medicine to uh, try and stop the petrification. And all it did was turn him into a zombie. Damn, that's fucked up. Shark pipe. <laughs> That's a weird item. What now? There's even treasure to be found in a collapsing shack. Find out what happened to the greedy couple. Okay. The greedy couple. That was almost death.
How many souls do I get for killing those guys? 93? That's it? That's terrible. It's like not even worth it. Um, okay. That was weird. Oh man, I don't have the key. That's fucked up. Sweet, okay. Woo. That was kind of sketchy. Ooh, what's in here? The slum shack. More zombies, cool. Just what I wanted. Damn it, it always makes your weight go up though. I don't want my weight to go up anymore. Gobbler's Bridge. Gobbler's Knob.
must have a shitload of those catalysts now. Because I rarely use them. Wait, I missed something back there, though. Because I never did, like... I never did let that... Oh, God. Oh, God. And the water is a little bit lifeless, but... Oh well. I think I missed something, though, back in, like... The area I was just in. Because there is this one thing that... There's, like, this one ladder that I never... Successfully dropped down. wonder how I get to that. It was like, let's see. Oh my god. Whenever you're just trying to run, run from one place to another, your stamina just makes you have to go really slow. And it sucks. See, I never did get up there. How does one get up there? Send out a raid in a minute, but I need to use that charge attack more. That shit is strong. What the hell? Yeah, how the fuck do I get up there? <sighs> Damn it.
I have no idea. I bet you get over there from like doing something all the way on the other side of that rock or something. I bet I just haven't gotten that far yet. Probably just wasting time by running around here. I bet that the answer will present itself eventually. Yeah, I bet it's like over here somewhere. Or maybe not. Oh yeah, because there's the bridge. Hmm. Well, fuck. Well, shit. Hmm. Bloody hell. I've got one of the original songs stuck in my head right now. my thing was charging fucking slow as shit. I just go back and get those stupid souls back real quick. And then I'll send out a raid. <sighs> Come on. At least that one guy stays dead, that's good. He despawned. Thank god. I did not mean to do that. Oh well.
Hell yeah. That wasn't too bad. I wonder how these giant creatures are like being created. Target info, unknown, sweeper's cat. Join the group as an apprentice stalker, but is inactive in the group. Hmm. Interesting. The bastards. Oh my god. I almost fucked up. Let's see. I can either go out on that beam or I can just do this. And get hurt, of course. Damn, the fall damage in this game is just really unforgiving. But the funny thing is, is like, I don't find myself dying by falling off cliffs very often at all, though. So it's like kind of fair. Because it almost never matters, but. Sometimes it does, and uh, does quite a bit of damage. Um, okay. Welcome to the territory of the Black Rabbit Brotherhood. Remember, anyone who fails to pay for the protection fee on time is headed straight for the coffin. Is there some kind of way to make those not disappear so fast? I want the heads up display on, blood on, motion blur. Just attack direction, switch lock on. Hmm. 
I'm level 50 now. That's kind of kind of badass. Whoa! I just like looked through that wall. That was weird. Hey, look! I met her before. Oh, I saw you go into the factory, but you're here. So, wait. You came out of the factory? That's a new one. That's a cool sword. You would have been burnt to a crisp. But look at you, all intact. Brother, being too frank is rude. We should praise him for being stronger than he looks. Why not join forces? Play our cards right, and we could defeat the villains who rule this area. They're the Black Rabbit's Brotherhood. The baddies who torments the residents around here. We heard their hideout is stuffed with treasure. And it's a good time to liberate this place as well. Pretty sweet. All you have to do is create a distraction. That's it. The rest we can handle. So, you gonna do it? I guess. I mean, they might just be tricking me, but whatever. Smart choice. Look at our smart friend, Gatto. Oh God! We're no slouches in the fisticuffs department. In a pinch, you lead. We'll bring up the rear and watch for hidden threats. This is gonna be just like the movie Pinocchio, where they basically just trick my ass. I'm sure. I'm sure it's not gonna go well, but whatever. All right, I gotta send out a raid now, though. I just see. You're full of surprise. Change is never easy. Look at me. A human trapped in the shackles of the past. I wish I was back in Krat before the petrification disease. Before the disaster. Krat was a city of light. A city of joy. I wish I could go back. Even just for one day. For one day. I'll use my power. I know you will. Dang, I'm never gonna have like... I'm never gonna not be heavy. What the hell? See, 30 vitality. I really need to get my capacity up higher. 70%. Dang, that's a lot. Of course, I need to start boosting my attack power again too soon. I'll try to get motivity up to 30 also. And capacity up to like 16 or 17 maybe. Dang, I really wish that I had a motivity crank again, because I would love to make this booster glaive like a strength weapon.
can see. I kind of could boost this up. Okay, I think I'm gonna call it there. Uh, it's kind of weird how I like went really far underground and then came out and ended up here. Like, doesn't really make sense, but that's okay. I want to just keep playing, but... Getting pretty tired, so... Well, let me find someone to raid first. Before I close that out. See, where's this person at right now? Can't tell if he's further. No, this is right where I was at. But he just started his stream, so. Hmm, shit. I'm gonna raid, uh... Friend of mine again real quick. Channel called Dim Frenemies. Let's see. Jewel, thank you again for the raid. Magi, thank you for the... Gifted sub and the 12 month resub. That's pretty sick. Michael's Deli, thank you for the raid. Uh, and Star Kitty, thank you for the raid. There's like three or four raids tonight. That's awesome. All right. But yeah, take care. Have a great night. And uh, I'll be back on Monday, probably. All right. Peace.